In this video, we're going to show you how to add hundreds upon hundreds of new Google fonts into your docs, sheets, and slides. Let's get started. Whenever you open up a Google Doc, Google Slides, or Google Spreadsheet, you have a basic choice of fonts to use. When you click on the font dropdown, you can see them here. It's your standard 20-ish fonts that you're used to. However, Google has a ton more fonts available to you at the click of a button. Simply go to your font dropdown and click on the first one. It says More Fonts. From here, you'll see a list of what you already have, but below it are some brand new fonts. And as you scroll down, you'll see that the list gets longer and longer and longer. There are hundreds and hundreds to choose from. If you're looking for a specific type of font, they've got some filters at the top. You can sort by type. You can sort by display, handwriting, monospace, serif, and you can sort it by popularity or alphabetical if you know what you're looking for. Once you see one that you like, you simply click on the button and hit OK and now your new font is uploaded and ready to go. One of the cooler things that Google has done here is that it automatically uploads to your other files. So if you were in a Google Slides, you just refresh your screen. Same thing with Google Sheets. And then once you've opened up a file, you simply click on a text box and you go to your drop down, and the new font is there waiting for you. Same thing in Google Sheets. Click in a cell, click in the drop down, and there it is again, ready for you. Some of you may be wondering if this font shows up once you share the document with somebody, and the answer is yes. I just shared it with a different account. As you can see here, I'm in a separate account, and I'm going to open up the shared doc. Even though I'm in a totally separate account, when I'm in this document, I have access to the separate font. As you can see here, it says Rock Salt. Even though in this particular account, I don't have it, it did add it for me automatically. And as you can see, when I type with it, it works just fine. Hey, you, watch more videos. Get to it. See you next time at Mr. Cook's Corner. Bye.